Dangerous summer heat is spreading across the U.S. Today, Boston baked, hitting a record 97 degrees. At least 82 million people are under heat alerts from the Atlantic coast to Midwest Plains. The weather is also extreme in the West. Jonathan Vigliotti is in Los Angeles with more. One of the hottest and driest regions in America was hit by a rare monsoon that triggered historic flash flooding in and around California's Death Valley National Park. Rescues are ongoing after a thousand people were trapped inside as mud flows forced the shutdown of every entrance and damaged some 60 cars. As of tonight, there were no reports of injuries. Around an inch and a half of rain was dumped in one day. That's about 75% of the region's annual total. Kentucky's Appalachian Mountains already struggling to recover from earlier flash flooding that left 37 dead are facing torrential rains again. President Biden and the First Lady will survey the damage on Monday. The powerful storms in the Northeast and Midwest are disrupting flights nationwide, delaying at least 3,000 flights and canceling more than 600. In Arizona, more than 20,000 lightning strikes have hit since Thursday as the state braces for more blistering heat. And firefighters in Washington state have saved the small town of Lind after gaining control of the flames that destroyed at least six homes. And back here in California, the McKinney fire, the state's largest fire, continues to burn near the Oregon border. Fire crews have made some progress, but there is a new threat. Wind gusts could reach up to 30 miles per hour tomorrow. Mark. Jonathan Vigliotti, thanks.